Oh man, I'm here to see an awesome show. You know, come on, Radio City is amazing. Garden of Dreams, great organization. These guys invite me every year to do uh, some fun things throughout the holidays and, and now in the summer. So um, I'm gonna be checking out the, the talent. Now, let's you know, let's face it. We know what these kids have been through. They've been through so much, and uh, they're our future, you know, leaders and stars of Broadway and wherever else as well. So um, I think that that you know really enhances the show for all of us as the audience. But um, I'm really happy for them all. This is a great honor to be here in this building with all the history. So I think it's just such a great night for these children to be able to get up on stage at Radio City and perform. I think you know I I want to perform on the stage, but I'm not going to do dance. <laughs> no, I was a gymnast, so like you know kind of dance background, but I would never call myself a dancer. I think never give up. It's, it sounds so cheesy, but it's so true. I think you can really accomplish anything you put your mind to, and no matter how many times someone tells you no, like you can't let it bother you and just keep going. I am so excited to be. I'm actually presenting one of the performers and um, growing up and loving the arts myself, I think it's great to always encourage kids to follow their dreams and um, giving them this opportunity is a night that they will never forget, especially because they're kids from the tri-state area and they know the significance of Radio City Music Hall. So um, I'm excited for them. I hope they have a great time and, and you know, this is definitely a night that they won't forget. I think it's great for kids to always have a goal, something that they're always striving for. And um, because, I mean, that's just how life is. I, I don't think it's in anyone's nature to want to be um, complacent. And um, for kids to have a goal and to always have something to work at, um, I, think that, I think that's great for them. We took the arts and we used it to empower each other. And that's what we're doing here with this talent show. This talent show isn't about just creating great entertainers. These kids are facing crazy obstacles. Physical obstacles like cancer and diabetes and emotional problems, economic um, problems, you know, homelessness, the mothers and fathers incarcerated, um, the mothers and fathers on drugs. So we're taking their heart so that even though they go up on that stage and give a good show, when they leave here, they have a confidence in life saying, man, I could, regardless of this cancer, man, I could defeat this. You know, regardless of my homeless situation, I could make it to school. You know, I could pass that test. I could get to college. I could help my family out. So it's just letting these kids know that, okay, yeah, your situation is crazy, but there's a beauty inside of you. There's a talent inside of you. There's a gift inside of you that can change your whole situation. Hey, what's up? I'm Adrian Bailon. Yo, yo, what's up, y'all? It's me, DMC, and a place to be, and only place for you to be. And you're rocking with Entertainment School. Because we got the school.